Okay, how's everybody doing this evening? Of course, my name is Kent. The channel is EOS San Diego. And I make videos about the EOS blockchain. Very interesting topic. And I enjoy it very much. So I want to talk a little bit tonight. Actually, I want to make reference to a video that my son made, uh, I think yesterday, about how to use the challenge application. Of course, we have launched a token. The token trades on many DEX decentralized exchanges, and um, and we uh, we have completed the challenge application, and we have built the challenge application, and it is running on the Apple Store. So, if you want to know how to use it, uh, I'll put a link to the video below, and I would appreciate it if you uh, if you would try it out, take a look at it. We've got some upgrades coming here, but uh, it's going to be a great application. It's got a lot of uses, a lot of use cases for this application. Uh, it's a way to to influence somebody's behavior. It's a way to make sure somebody comes to work on time. It's a way. It's a it's a it's a it's a, it's a way to make sure somebody shows up when you want them to show up. There's a lot of different use cases with this application, and I got a lot of activity behind me. I hope it's not influencing the video. But there's a lot of lot, lot of ways to use this application, and we are increasing the ways of using it and we're coming up with more and more ideas all the time. The, the UI, the interface is gonna change. Uh, of course, we're gonna hopefully get away from using the private keys. Um, that's gonna change, there's a lot of things that are gonna change about it. So anyway, I'm gonna put a link in on how to use it below. Take a look at it, check it out. Also, we'll be in the Google Play Store here very quickly too. But the main thing I wanna talk about tonight, I wanna to talk about the fact of, I was listening to a Telegram channel the other day and they were talking about the use of, of, of actually if, if, if EOS is money. Is EOS actually money? And they were arguing that EOS is not money. EOS is a utility, but it's actually not money, which I think is an interesting idea. And I can make an argument that it is money, and I can make an argument that it isn't money. And that's what we're going to talk about tonight. Uh, actually, anything can be money because money is just a use of exchange. Uh, so if you have confidence in something, it, it's money. So if I if I, I can use matchsticks, I can use uh, beads, I can use uh, I can use practically anything. If somebody else has confidence in that, and they're willing to exchange uh, value for whatever it is I'm using for value, and we're able to exchange it, then that is money. The one thing about money is it's got to have other people feel like they want to own it too. So there's going to have to be a confidence layer to it. So in the fact that EOS is money. I believe that it is money because there is confidence in the blockchain. There's confidence in the, the value of it. There's con confidence in trading it. And there's confidence that uh, there's value in owning block uh, uh, EOS. So in that respect, respect, EOS is absolutely money. It's absolutely money because people want to own it. Uh, and they're willing to give real fiat for it. So that indicates that the, that the, that the, the EOS coin is absolutely money. The way that EOS is not money is that money technically doesn't change value. So in other words, the only way money can change value is if you put it at risk. So, I mean, money really technically isn't. So if you own real estate, you don't really don't have money, you have real estate. If you own uh, stocks, you really don't have stocks, you, have, you don't have really money, you have stocks. And every time you put your stock or your real estate at risk by owning it, when you, the, the price of it can fluctuate, it's not really money because the price can go up and down. So if the price can go up and down, it's not money because money really technically is just a store of value and it, and it should always be worth the same. So there shouldn't be. So the fact that EOS is something that fluctuates and the fact that it can go up and down and that it is at risk means that it's not money. So I would say, and this was a very interesting uh, discussion that was going on in in Telegram, I would say EOS is money in the respect that it is a trusted system. It's very trusted and there's confidence in it and people are willing to own it. But in the true sense of if it, if it is money or not, it's not because uh, it's not money because it's something that fluctuates in value. And uh, as far as it being utility, I mean, I don't know what people mean by, by being a utility, by being the fact that if it isn't money, then it's a utility then a utility meaning people use it and people are willing to build on it and everything like that. But the fact that it, that it doesn't 
you know, the, that the utility isn't something that changes value is kind of an interesting concept to me. But anyway, I, I was listening to this argued the other day on, on Telegram, and I thought it was an interesting exchange. And uh, I would say it's both money, it's both, both is and isn't money. So I think that's what he does. I appreciate you watching. Thank you very much.